Hunger cravings. Hunger cravings. That is one of the number one things that people struggle with while on Moon Face Maker. They feel so hungry. And it's not like a pregnancy craving. Pregnancy cravings are for like one thing. Like when I was pregnant with one kid, I just loved Winger's chicken salad. Mm, so good. I made my husband drive me to Winger's at like nine o'clock at night so that we could have some because I was gonna die if I didn't have it. And then another child, I just inhaled broccoli. Like broccoli. What was it about broccoli? Who knows? But I would eat like a whole head of broccoli. It was so delicious to me. And then for another child, we lived in New York City at the time, and there was a farmer's market in Central Park. And it was a half a mile from my apartment. And I would pile my toddler into my stroller and walk a half a mile, because I didn't have a car, like who has a car in New York City? And walk down to this farmer's market every Saturday while I was pregnant so that I could get those fresh, delicious pickles straight from the farm. Oh my goodness. They were like cold and salty and so good. And so that's what I craved. One thing, just one thing while I was pregnant. With prednisone, moon face maker, it's different. You feel so hungry and there's no stopping the hunger. Like you can eat until it hurts and it, you're still hungry. Like it doesn't matter how much you've already eaten, you might still feel hungry. And so we have to take diff different strategies into mind and to, to think of them. The reason is because there's a signal between your brain and your appetite. And it is lacking when we're on Moon Face Maker. There's an interference in that system. And so we have to use our brains to say, I think I've actually eaten enough, right? I have to use my brain instead of my appetite to decide when to stop eating. And that is super duper hard but it's worth it because that's how we prevent moon face. I definitely had moon face. I definitely gained weight while I was taking moon face maker. And I discovered some strategies that I'm gonna share with you today. So first of all, you want to drink lots of water because the water will help satisfy some of that, whether it's the physical stretching of your tummy and how much space is being taken up, it can help with that. Or it can help just making you feel less thirsty. And sometimes we confuse hunger with thirst and it's just kind of how our signals work. And so if we have already quenched the thirst, it's gonna be easier to quench the hunger. So, or to satisfy the hunger. So that's the first thing is to drink water. Drink two cups before every meal if you can. Then, that's number one. Number two is sugar. If we cut out sugar, that's fighting back against exactly where Moon Face Maker is hitting us. So cut out the sugar. Next, eat nutrient dense foods. That means not eating things that came from a package, from a plant, things that are whole, things that are what your great great grandmother would have eaten if she would have eaten it then it's good to eat if she'd never heard of it like mm, a twinkie then maybe we shouldn't eat it especially while we're on prednisone it'll help you heal better too when you're eating food that can build you up because food is medicine food is our number one medicine that we can use to fight back so I encourage you to use that food as medicine. And the question is, do you want moon face? Do you want long-term consequences? 
Or do you want to fight back where you can fight back? Change the things that are in your control to change. If you want to know more about the top seven mistakes people on Moonface Maker make, that was funny, Maker Make, um, you should check it out. I have a checklist that includes those top seven mistakes and then what you can do about it. Some things we can't do anything about, but a lot of things when it comes to Moonface Maker, we can do something. We can fight back. And so I encourage you to get that checklist and um, let me know which of the seven surprised you the most and which of them that you already knew about. I'll give you a hint. One of them we just talked about. Eating nutrient-dense foods. Signing off as Dr. Megan, the Moonface Pharmacist.